Okay, so we are back once again. I've done a little bit of an audio change. Um, I'm hoping that this audio sounds a little bit better, a little better mix. Um, brought the uh, the voices down. I realized that they were like way, way too loud. Um, and a couple other things too. My voice is still, it, I don't know, to me it still sounds like a bit distorted. Um, I know my voice is a little raspy to begin with, but I didn't, I don't know, it just doesn't seem quite right. Um, so... Yeah, anyways, um, so we have a, a couple ships moving around here. This colony ship going up there. Um, that one going over there, I guess. Um, this uh, space factory is going over to here. Oh, no, it's going back all the way over here because it's going to work on uh, that after it builds one of these because it's probably going to beat this. All right. So, dun 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 dun. dun. All right, let's keep going. Choose production. What do we want? What do we need? Hmm. Sorry, my cat is purring. If you can hear that. Um, pollution nine. That's not too bad. Um, but here, let's uh build that to help get rid of that. And. Move that along. Excellent. And let's see here. Fleet needs instructions. <laughs> um, hmm. Not really sure where to send him. Or them, rather. Um, I guess I'll just have them... Actually, I'll have them go there and guard. Because right now, that's the only, like, undefended point. Alright, we got terraforming. That's great. Ooh, so this is great. So we can take gas giants and turn them into actual planets. Uh, that's actually really helpful. Yeah, I'm totally going to go with that. Controller, you might want to see this. Okay, next turn. Just keep moving, get these guys going to their respected spots. This guy can discard, because we don't have uh, tech to go there yet. Multi state, yeah, it's that one there. Yeah, so we have, uh, we'd have a couple techs we'd have to go through. In order to uh, to reach that, so it's a little ways down the road. We'll get there eventually, but I wanna I wanna build up this area, and make sure it's pretty secure before I uh, venture out. Although sometimes it is nice to venture out early, um, and uh, and take some of their stuff before they they can get into yours. But, you know, it's all different ways you want to play. Oh, morale is lower than I would like it. Um, let's throw in a space elevator. Terraform. Zero pollution, though. That's good. Um, let's take a look at... So we have three people that are... On strike, that's not good. Ugh. And once again, I forgot a timer. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> I think I'm gonna leave that. It's only three. I, I can I can deal with that for now. For now. Choose production. Uh, let's go that, that, that. Uh, and eventually we're going to want a star base too. Oof, we have a lot of pollution. Um, actually, let's put 
Oh, that's not actually not what I wanted. I don't want terraforming. I want pollution cleanup. And we're going to do that right after that one goes in. Alright, choose production. Oh, well, they're actually doing really good. Morale-wise, not so great. Um, but it's okay. Um, we can throw in a government facility for that. Cloning facility, get some population going. Alright, so that filled up that queue. Okay. Alright, so we're actually going to send this guy here. This one's going there. Colonize. Yeah, the background image, really? Ugh, I don't know. It's not doing it. Not doing it for me. The ship looks great, though. That's, that's, that's awesome. I like that. Alrighty. Um, definitely automated factory, biosphere, hydroponics, and then let's get a atmosphere generator. Welcome Tintin. to GNN. The Cylon Quanta has grown in strength. Well, thank you for the update. Um, okay, choose production. Mm. Go through all these regular ones. Oh, government facility. Actually, we probably should move that one up a bit. Um, since our morale isn't that great, we can bump that up and maybe get him off the strike. Um, let's see here. Next turn. We'll move him. We'll have him build us a military outpost. Do that. Alright, and that's gonna seal us off um pretty well. So yeah. That'd be kinda nice actually. That'd be good. We can have a, a good solid start with this area we control. Alright. Um, so next turn. Right. Oh, looks like our research finished. So now we can do gas giants and artificial planets out of, the uh, out of asteroids. Hmm, dun 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 dun. What do we want to do? Yeah, it, mm, hmm. The problem with this one is that it's restricted to poor and ultra poor planets. It does give us two manufacturing though, which is kind of nice. The other one only gives us one, but it's available on any place. Oh, it's per cell. For research. Oh, and actually we get them both. I thought this was an ore one. Yeah, we'll definitely do that. Welcome to GNN, Galactic News Network. Population has boomed at a Cylon as the... Okay. So there's a population boom. Yippee, uh, yeah. Even without me, out all right. We have an alien management center. Alien psychology. That's actually kind of nice. Effectiveness for dealing with other races. We can definitely use that later on. Oop, pirate fleet was detected. We'll just scoot right there. Excellent. And let's go tactical. I wanna, I wanna see these guys in action again. It's been a while. Plus, um, the audio levels. 
kind of curious the new audio levels how this sounds all right um. Um, it sounded good to me. <laughs> we'll see uh, later on if, uh, if it came through in the recording properly. Um, but wow, that actually that worked uh, quite well. Um, so there's got to be some some sort of pirate base or whatever out here. So I'm going to go check that out. Um, what do we get? 19% pollution, that's not cool. We'll throw up these, uh, uh, it's 10 turns, so yeah, we'll, we'll put that up. Um, actually, let's cue that afterwards. So that way we can get food, and then we'll clean up the pollution, and then we can have, uh, some extra research. Some science. For science! Next turn... Oh. Yeah. Um, we're gonna go with the alien psychology so it gives us a better effect for our um, dealings with other races because um, I, I mean the alien management center I don't know I've taken over planets before of other people's stuff and I'm like yeah it's fine it, it's okay they they conform eventually all right Mmm, fusion bombs. I want to say yes. That wasn't such a high number, I would go for that. I kind of want to do some quick tech right now. And the buyout thing, I don't know. Okay. Let's go that, let's get these fusion bombs. Um, I haven't tried the fusion beam yet, but uh, the fusion bombs are pretty nice. A bit more effective than nuclear bombs. Alright, we now have one of those uh, starport or military outposts um, on every inlet to our little oasis. Um, oops, Fleet B. So we're going to go and bring our space factory to this asteroid belt area thing. And uh, we're going to actually create a planet. Boom. Take that. And what we're going to do is we're going to convert all of these gas giants and asteroid belts into planets and colonize those. So, um... Controller, new development. Yeah, required. fusion bomb. Uh, I'm not going to update my blueprints. I, I, I think I've probably mentioned this before, but I don't like to do that because they always mess it up. They, I don't know why that happens, but they just always do. Ooh, Ion Drive. That is that is, that is a really good one. I know Ion Pulse Beam, it's nice. I think that even has point defense. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. But, um, but I have to say, uh, the Ion Drive, I just I like having more... Eureka! More, sp not space, but more uh, distance that I, my fleet can travel at once. It really, uh, it, it increases your range immensely. I think I am really tired because I'm not talking properly. Um, oh, yeah, you should uh, attack them. <laughs> so, dead. Excellent. What do we get? Destruction of the pirate base. Yeah. I'll, I'll take it. Alrighty. Welcome to GNN. Galactic Look. News Network. Births are once again under control in the no longer rapidly ex and now the state of the galaxy. All right. The census rankings of empire populations. Nice. 
So we have 60. The Sakura which are, I think, our enemies. Let's go to diplomacy for a second. Um. Oh, so yeah, the Mashan, We've already we've already taken them out. Um, these guys are not happy with us so far at all. Um, well, it's interesting. Like they don't give me the same the same setup. I'd like to compare with them. Oh, but you know what we can do? Uh, we can go to Path to Victory, and we can say View Timeline and a Graph, and then I can just throw Sakura up there. Ooh. So their score is way higher than mine. Holy cow. Their army must be, yeah. Yep, their army is way, way bigger. Population-wise, though, I'm crushing them. Colonies-wise, crushing them. Credits-wise, crushing them. But because they have a bigger army, they have a higher score. Which is fine, because right now I don't really need a ginormous army. Um... But eventually, yes, I will be building that up. Um, but first, I want a fleet of colony ships. New and all this tech immediate. that I'd have to upgrade later anyway. So, like, just, yeah. Get the tech out of the way, then build up your fleet. And no, I'm not going to upgrade those. Oh, shoot, actually, I sh <laughs> probably should have. Oh, well, you know what? Oh, another antimatter drive. Oh, excellent. So, you know what? I'm going to go there. And then I will actually upgrade all those, and then I'll have to fix all of the uh, the military ships afterwards. Which I'm going to have to anyways, because, you know, um, other things are going to affect how they are. And I'm going to have fusion bombs and all that. And all, so, yeah. There's going to be some, some serious changes. Alright. Uh, next turn. All right, so finally, some place uh, excellent. Okay, let's. Okay, let's build a couple colony ships. So I'm gonna build three. And then, well, then we're probably gonna have to do. Uh, Pollution control, so we'll just we'll just hold off for that right now. Yeah, we'll just guard there. Next turn. Choose production. Government facility. Atmospheric controller. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Next turn. Alright, I'm going to need another space factory here. Oops, I don't need two of them. Um, and... Wait, what am I looking at? Pollution-wise, we're perfectly fine. Um... Yeah, build that. And then... Uh, let's do that. Okay, so now I gotta colonize another planet here. Um, and actually, 12 turns. I wonder how many turns. It's gonna take me 10 turns to get there, so it's actually almost perfect. I'll just have to hang out for two turns. Um, oh, and another colony ship. Oh, spin these things out. I. I forgot that there are only four turns per. It's radiated. Uh, 
I kind of... This one's actually not terrible. It's definitely not great, but it's not terrible. Actually, that's not too bad. I think I'm actually going to go there. Yeah, I think I'm going to go that little blue one there. It's on the other, other side of the... Uh, it's going to take forever, but... Cool. So... That's interesting. So, next turn... Controller, new developments require your immediate attention. Yeah, so we're definitely gonna go with this. Even without me, our scientists have made a new decision. Um, and then we're gonna, yeah, Controller, we're actually gonna upgrade all those. Require... Um, but then we're gonna have to do, oh, ooh, the pulse on missiles, those are amazing. Um, yeah, we're definitely going to do that. Um, and we're definitely not going to upgrade that because... Okay, we're going to have to go into ship design. We're going to have to redo these. Um, yeah, I mean, clearly. Like, the whole... The, everything's just all messed up in us. Alright, so... Do have an antimatter drive. I just want to make sure we got everything the highest rate in the core systems. Which it looks like we do, and usually that is the case when you upgrade. They usually don't downgrade you for that. Um, gonna go reinforced hull. Uh, oh, sorry, yeah, reinforced hull. Uh, mass driver. I guess we could do four of those. Um. Do nine of those, and then... Yeah, so then we got two fusion bombs. We got n ten missiles, technically, but one's really fast, so hopefully their point defense will go up to that one instead of hitting these. And then we got um, four point defense systems. Boosted hull. Yeah, that's not too bad. We'll go with that. Then we'll uh, check out the frigate. Again, I think everything there is correct. Do that. And you can't do double battle pods um, to give you twice as much extra space. Um, unfortunately. I wish I wish that was the case. That would be awesome. Um, but you can't. Uh, oof. So, yeah, looks like that or, mm, yeah, no, I think that's good. Yeah, I was thinking we could go more missiles, but no. Curious, what are these? Ooh, the Merv. Hmm. Ooh, wow, that's expensive. Holy cow, you see the, the size difference there? That's 40 difference. That's ridiculous. That's, it doubles. It, it doubles how much you're actually using. Wow. I mean, yeah, I might, uh, I might use that eventually, but I don't know. 
I, I don't know. All right, let's edit this cruiser down. Um, mass driver six, neutron blaster. Seriously, that's what this thing had for. That's just sad. Okay, and actually, we're gonna. I'm just gonna do five of those and then finish these up. All right, and. I'm going to put a cut in here. So, until next time.